Happy Wednesday. Thanks for clicking to WYTV.com. I'm meteorologist Ryan Halicki. A beautiful Wednesday, lots of sunshine and high pressure that is in control of the region will stay with us here through the end of the week. This has brought us all of our sun today. We have a lot more to look forward to as we head through the rest of our work week here. Once again tonight could be a little bit of patchy fog. The outlook here showing those pockets trying to develop. It's especially for low lying areas and valleys and mainly early in the morning with all the sunshine that we'll have in place. That'll burn off pretty quickly and as we go through the rest of the day. Once again, looking for a lot more sun. Now overnight lows, well, those temperatures, they will be nice and cool in the morning. So some crisp fall mornings for your Thursday morning, Friday, Saturday morning too, and then a little warmer Sunday. That's because the next storm system arrives and that's going to be bringing us some clouds, also some showers. So we'll walk through this here for your Wednesday evening, staying nice and quiet. We're back down in the 40s, about mid 40s to start the day. Lots of sun for your Thursday, kind of a repeat of what we had for today. We'll look for temperature low to mid 60s by noon afternoon highs trying to near 70. There is a little pocket of some cooler air that'll be overhead here may keep us from actually hitting that 70 degree mark, but it won't be far off from where our highs were today feeling very similar for your Thursday evening. Again, more of the same here, mainly clear skies, temps down in the 40s. I do think we could be a few degrees colder for the start of our Friday, more so in the low 40s. And as we go through the day, though, we'll once again have a lot of sunshine. So temperatures on Friday back to the low to mid 60s by noon and the highs back near 70 degrees. High school football, no weather worries. As you see a quiet view on future cast here as we come up on those games, we'll be dropping out of the 60s and through the 50s by those final plays. So you'll want the hoodies. It will be a little cool by the end of the game. Games. Let's talk about our weekend storm system here as we get to Saturday. It's on the approach, but Saturday is still going to be a dry day. We'll have sunshine early. I do expect some clouds running out ahead of this rain here, so likely to see skies trending more toward partly sunny conditions as we get into the late afternoon and evening. Saturday night is when those rain chances come up. We'll start looking for the first batch of rain working in overnight into daybreak Sunday. And then Sunday looks a little more of a drearier day. Lots of clouds and scattered showers around the storm system still impacting our weather Monday, where we'll continue to see clouds and showers around the valley. So thumbs up for the next 24 hours. We'll put fog back on the hassle factors list and temps. We'll call it a little cool here as we go to 45 degrees, but clear and starry skies watching for patchy fog into tomorrow morning and then sunshine thereafter. The afternoon high near 70 degrees on a mostly sunny Thursday, Friday. Also looking pretty great here. Mostly sunny skies and around 70 there. Saturday a little warmer, mid 70s, and then those clouds building in Saturday evening. Rain showers developing Saturday night, and we'll have that scattered rain around on Sunday and Monday. Both days look mainly cloudy with off and on showers and temperatures in the 60s there. For Tuesday, a chance for showers lingers. We'll look for a few more holes in the clouds, giving us a little bit more sunshine in there. And then by next Wednesday, we're back into the low to near mid 70s. Isolated shower possible with partly sunny skies.